Hey everybody, the Abilene Painter here again. We're, uh, we're on day two of the Brown Project. Um, I just kind of wanted to go through a little bit of what we're doing here today. Um, we got, we have uh, all of our cabinetry prepped here. Uh, <clears throat> well, not all of it, this is the old stuff. Okay, so what we did is we just shored up all these, all these crevices here around the doors. And as you can see, we got all these all these pretty much prepped. They're, uh, uh, they're, uh, they're places where paint can really pull up and you really want to get them taken care of. You want to get them shored up. Now what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to come back and we're going to have to scuff these. And that's a light sand in order to uh, allow the primer to get some bite. You want the primer to get some bite and with this, with this type of finish, since we're refinishing these, what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to scuff them up well enough to where we can put uh, two coats of primer on them. We gotta get two coats of primer on them so that we can hide all of this grain and want them to match all of the rest of the cabinetry that's getting sprayed throughout the house. So we need to get all of that grain hidden and so that that scuffing is gonna really give us, give us a great um, surface for the primer to bite on. And uh, as you can see, we wanna make this look like one box. So we've got the interior here all caulked. We also went ahead and shored up the, uh, the screw holes here. We just have to kind of get those flush here in a little bit so that we can get those all taken care of. Um, <clears throat> right now what I'm doing over here is we're just going ahead and in any little crevice, we're just putting some lightweight spackling in all these little crevices where two pieces of wood meet, as you can see, and that'll dry down and we can come back with a wet with a wet, uh, a slightly damp rag or, or even a, you know, a real fine grade piece of sandpaper and just take all that excess off. But that's pretty much what we're doing that. Um, and then of course, we're getting the other stuff ready. You know, we're gonna be um, spraying here in the next day or so. So we started all the caulk. We started all the caulk. Um, again, this is, just anywhere where a joint meets, um, alongside the wall here, you want to get all that taken care of. Anywhere where, it, you know, another piece of wood meets another piece of wood. When we're done spraying this, it's going to look like one piece. It's going to look like one box. All right, so we're going to go ahead and, you know, keep uh, keep doing all the prep on that. We've still got some more to do. Uh, we got some of it done down here, but we got to get that that box yet. Um, uh, I mean, that's pretty much what we're doing here. As you can see, if I turn you around again, we got all of these cabinets here. And these are the doors over here. And these are the drawers. So we're going to get these all caulked on the inside. You see where that gap is along these edges and in the corners? We're going to make this look like, a, like one, one box. And that's also what we're going to be doing for all these. This right here, I'm going to tell you right now, anybody who's looking to get cabinets like this done in their house, just to give you an idea of the enormity of the, the work that goes into something like this, this entire cabinet setup, just on caulking alone, will take an entire day. It will take an entire day for one person. It'll probably take three quarters of a day to a half a day for two people, and that's two people who are relatively fast um, and know which, where all the areas are that need to be caulked. Uh, again, I'm just kind of bringing you guys along for this project just so that you guys can see what we're really doing here. Um, inside here, this is all prepped. We just got to do the scuffing before we put on our, before we spray our primer coats. But yeah, I mean, we're all caulked in here. You know, anywhere where you got box meeting molding, you want that caulked in along the wall edges. Inside the box or in the back or on the corners, just any, you know, anywhere where wood meets wood or wood meets wall, basically. Anywhere where paint can pull up. Got down in here already. We got all that to short up, stored, taken care of there. And of course we're just, we're gonna be working our way back through here. But today, by the end of the day, I'm going to plan to have all of these doors Okay, all of these cabinet and vanity doors, kitchen cabinet doors, all the doors are taken off of here. This, we're gonna have to scuff this as well. But I wanna get all of these done, um, all of the doors and the drawers done today. 
I don't think we're going to get all the caulking and the bathrooms done today, but um, we're, going get, we're going to get pretty far. We're going to get a pretty, a pretty solid amount of work done. So that's basically uh, what we're doing here today. That's basically what it is out here on the Brown Project. Uh, so uh, stay tuned for another update, and uh, appreciate you coming along for the ride. This is the Abilene Painter, signing off.